Yeah, hey, this is Steve Johnson, and I have a short, I'm going to try and keep this under three minutes, video on, um, uh, I'm making colloidal silver, and one of the, a couple of, I do a couple of things that are slightly different than everyone else. I have a pretty standard setup. I like, um, I like the nine volts. I use, uh, I, I'm actually using two here. Let me show you the, the, the improvement. I think it's an improvement. Um, so uh, this is just a, um, alligator clips and and so a lot of people are just using alligator clips to to run from the the silver electrodes the silver wire to the the batteries um, uh, it has a uh, there's a 100k ohm resistor soldered in there as well and the result is that if you complete a circuit with this it will light up I'm gonna oh, I must have done that backwards um, LEDs are um, they only work one direction so uh, so if you don't get light, flip it around, and I, I think you can probably see that pretty well. Um, so here's what the LED does for me. It let me, lets me know that I'm creating colloidal silver. If it's not lighting up, something's not hooked up right, and if it is lit up, I've got a complete circuit, and I'm very likely creating colloidal silver. Um, I've done one other thing. We can see here I have a, a setup that's actually running right now. Um, I just did this, and I don't know if I like it or not, but I threw a 100K ohm pot in there, and here's the, so I'm sure some of you that are running 9 volts have seen a, a puddle almost of silver collect around the top of your electrodes. You know, if you can see it, that is very large. Uh, I mean, technically the definition of colloidal is anything that will stay in suspension. So it, it, it might still be a colloid, but I argue that, that, that uh, I argue that that is not good if you can actually visibly see the particles with your eyes, or in my case, with my spectacles. Um, but so what I'm doing to try to get rid of that problem is I'm throwing a re resistor in there. It's a potentiometer. As the conductivity of the uh, liquid improves because we're adding, um, creating colloidal silver, it'll become more conduct conductive as it runs. You can crank up the resistance on that, and you can crank it up. Uh, you know, as long as the LED is still lit, you've still got electricity flowing and you're, you're still presumably producing um, uh, colloidal silver. That's it. I hope all of you enjoy and um, hope everyone has a good day. Bye-bye.